Well, hello to all my wonderful YouTube fans. How are you doing today? Well, thank you so much for tuning in today's awesome vlog. Guys, on what I'm doing, I got a non unboxing uh, vlog for you today. It's something to do with a computer port, basically a storage hard drive. It's a Russian original 3 terabyte, uh, basically for my brand new rig I built, uh, basically. If you're kind of curious, I went down to my local Best Buy not too long ago and basically picked up this drive for about a hundred dollars. Awesome. Well, let's go ahead and take it out of the bag here and basically show you what it is. There it is. Basically, this is the mechanical drive right here. And we're going to take a look at it. Right. Some information on the sides. Some information on the back. And this over here. Well, let's go ahead and unbox this bad boy. But basically, all you're going to need is some screws. Okay. Pow and SATA. And very simple. Let's go have some fun and unbox the wonderful brand new drive. All my wonderful fans out there, I'm going to help you and try to understand what is a SATA cable. It's basically something that connects to the motherboard, to the hard drive. Basically all it is, is nothing but a data cable, uh, basically. This is what a SATA cable looks like on both ends. Okay. Right. And by the way, and this drive is also SATA as well. Let's go ahead and unbox this brand new drive. Uh, should I say? And let's get into it. Uh, of course, we have to use the annoying sticky glue stuff. <laughs> yeah, that's what they always do. Seal up the package nation, uh, nicely, you know? All right. Of course, inside the box is the actual drive itself. And of course, yeah, wonderful and awesome instructions. Yeah, nice. We actually included some hard drive screws. Nice. And this is what a three terabyte drive looks like. Awesome. All my fans, I do apologize. I did not film me installing the brand new hard drive in my brand new computer, but basically it's very simple. All you do is you take out six screws, four on the bottom, two on the inside, and also put screws to hold the drive into place. Of course, it's not a toolless design, but you also need a screwdriver. But let's go ahead and show you what I mean. Okay, here is my brand new rig itself. Of course, I really love the Gigabyte layout of the uh, BIOS. It's very nice and very easy to use. But if you can kind of see, here is my three terabyte drive down here. Of course, here is the hard drive caddy. But let's take a look at this Russian digital drive. This is a two terabyte. There is SATA data and SATA power. It's very simple to hook up. Now this is also a known storage drive I use for my videos. But basically here's everything being recognized by the computer itself. Very nice. But of course we're going to have to do some formatting on this brand new drive. Let's go ahead and have some more fun. Why ain't you seeing your new hard drive on your computer? But here's the thing I'm going to explain. You had to format the hard drive, 
okay it's a brand new drive it doesn't have anything on it and by the way it's not a defective drive but let's go ahead and show you what I mean next here is my rig you can kind of see chilling over here okay here is my boot drive my local drive of course here is my DV drive we're not worried about those we're worried about something else right minimize that go into your control panel right here go towards the top go here go to disk management now you can kind of see right here here's my boot drive we don't want to mess with that we want to right click it on the mouse put a new partition you hit next 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 and you can name it whatever you want to name it you can call it any type of storage name like YouTube video storage or just storage completely and we're just going to go ahead and hit format and basically it's going to format this brand new drive and let's go ahead and close out of all these windows and basically she is right here Ta -da! you got your new drive and there you go there's some storage for you using windows 10 home edition or pro edition as well i'm going to show you how you can actually save your data on the mechanical drive instead of on your ssd but basically you take your mouse you go down to the start menu go into settings okay this is what the settings look like go into system go to storage you can kind of see here is my ssd and here is my three terabyte drive uh, for youtube videos we're going to change the option of storage you can kind of see all these different windows uh, what we want is basically videos and we hit the apply and basically that's going to change my videos from my SSD to the actual storage drive and that's going to be awesome and you can also change everything if you choose like pictures music personal files and apps and that's good to go you can use whatever type of mechanical storage hard drive you decide to use basically the reason why i'm doing this is to show you how you can use the mechanical drive for storage instead of using your ssd uh, for storage now this ssd is nothing but just a boot drive and i have a three terabyte drive just for storage alone but it's own types of capacity drives you can use uh, basically, you got a 2 terabyte, a uh, 3 terabyte, a 4 terabyte, or you can even go all the way up to a 8 terabyte mechanical storage drive. But basically, I do get a little bit frustrated when I make uh, my YouTube vlogs for you because I'm trying to explain the best I can to educate you on how you can do things with your computers and also mechanical storage drives but all right if you guys and girls are also building the new channel please hit that subscribe button leave an awesome comment down below please like please show peace out we'll hopefully see you in the future vlog i do apologize i hope this vlog ain't too long catch you later